Knee injuries are among the most common and debilitating of all injuries. Many times they require surgery and extensive rehabilitation. But with some basic knowledge and a little hard work, you can prevent such injuries and look forward to staying injury-free for a lifetime. By participating in this program, you'll be able to increase the strength and stability of your knees. You might have seen some of these exercises before, but let's focus on how to do them correctly. Technique is crucial. If the technique is wrong, you aren't learning how to avoid injury. So pay close attention to the video. Watch the examples of how to perform each exercise correctly and watch the incorrect way of doing the exercise so that you can avoid the most common mistakes. Let's get started. Throughout the video, you'll hear us stress soft landing. Let's take a moment to explain what that entails. In order to protect your knee, when you land from a jump, you need to land on the ball of your foot with a bent knee and hip. This allows you to safely accept the weight of your body through your knee and utilize the right muscles for a safe landing. Let's take a look at how this is done. As our athlete comes down from his jump, notice his hip, knee, and ankle are in a straight line. His knee stays over the ankle joint, not translating over the toe. He lands on the ball of his foot with bent knee and hips. The back is neutral, not arched. This is correct form. Now let's look at some common errors. Watch athlete number two as she comes down. She lands with a flat foot, her knees cave inward, and they translate too far over her toes. These are the things we are trying to avoid. 